Hey everyone, it's Julia here from Money Energy Flow, the yoga of money, checking in with you for the Wednesday Live. And my offering this week was I did promise to share with you how the book launch went. So as some of you know from last week, I went to a launch on International Women's Day of a book that I am in called Intrepid Women. 12 Tales of Courage. So I'm not the only author, I'm one of 12. We're all co-authors and we contributed to this joint work. And I was looking forward to the event, I have to say. I was, I was very nervous. I think I remember I got on last week and I was a little bit emotional and I was nervous. I was looking forward to it. But a part of me did think, oh, you know, maybe I won't enjoy it that much. Uh, it could be a promotional event. You do have to go through with these things to launch a book. And of course it was an event designed to do that. So there was the, you know, photography and the stuff we all had to do, but actually it was quite cool. It was quite fun and exciting. But what really blew me away was that I hadn't read any of the other women's chapters. Because when we were given the final manuscript to, to do the last proofread and edit, we were told by the publisher, there's no time, we need your responses back, there's a certain deadline, please do not read all the stories because you won't get to edit your chapter. So of course I just read my chapter, maybe a teeny weeny little bit of the woman behind me. So I didn't really know what everyone was going to share when they went up on stage, but you know, I was blown away, like seriously blown away by the amount of courage, vulnerability, uh, humbleness. The stories were so powerful yet humble. I was blown away and thank God I wasn't the first speaker. I was kind of in the middle batch. And so a number of the women had already spoken before and I was so moved by their talks that when I got up to speak, I was highly emotional for the first little bit. And my friends could tell, you know, I was wobbling with the microphone, all of that. And then I just clicked in and I was so inspired by what they had said and what they had done in their lives that I just clicked in and was able to give my talk. So yeah, I wanted to share that with you. It was an unexpectedly way more powerful event than any of us expected. I had friends, Sally, my best friend came along, I had another friend, Penny and her husband came along and they just both said, all of them said afterwards, wow, we enjoyed this way more than we thought we would. So it's, I don't know whether it was the combination that it was International Women's Day and so there was a heightened feeling in the room of the power that we all have to make change. And I would say, it was focusing on the women, but not just the women, the men who were there to support them, uh, the families that came to support them. And the keynote speakers, we had two amazing guest speakers, and one is a female member of parliament here in Australia, and the other one is in local government here in our city. And they both gave really amazing talks as well. And I, I honestly, you can kind of say, you know, cliche things, yada 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 international women's day yada yada you can say all these cliche things but honestly i have not been to an event that really touched my heart in that way for such a long time and at the end of the day i realized you know this is not just my book this is not my book i'm one of 12 so i'm one twelfth of the quality of what's in here so you know i want to shout out to all the other women who are in this book as well and encourage you, if you're interested, I'll pop the link below. If you want to read their stories, so worthwhile. I gained so much from it. I was, you know, I'd met these women on a Zoom call, but I hadn't heard all of their background story. And that to me just blew me away. It was so inspiring. And you know what? I had a great night. So I'm wishing you all an awesome week. I hope you guys had some kind of insight or aha on International Women's Day, whether you are a woman or not. You know, I heard men in the room turn around and give their insights about it too. And, um, you know, I'd love to hear your comments. Post your comments below. I'll respond to you. I love these lives when there's interaction. And I wish you all a fantastic week. Bye-bye.